Now, the Association of uh, Commodity Markets Women and Men of Nigeria has uh, called on Markets Women leader Blacky Ogeme, uh, Ogeme to account for the 100 million naira allegedly uh, given to the session in 2013 by former governor Adam Sashemale. The group alleges that uh, Ogeme uh, allegedly sent over two cows and 500 bags of rice to Edo Central and Edo North, causing her to divert 460 bags of rice and 21 cows to our personal use. This press conference has become necessary owing to the reality on ground and the need to salvage our image as traders from the antics and bad relationship of Blacky Ogiame, who has become a reoccurring dirty man in the narrative of inflation, bad leadership, oppression, corruption, particularly as it pertains to embezzlement of funds made for the Edo traders. For the records, Mrs. Blacky Ogiamir is the Secretary of Edo State Market Women Association and card carrying member of People's Democratic Party, PDP, who has become like the uh, proverbial tortoise on any issue concerning market women in Edo State. We are therefore taken aback and found the need to pass a vote of no confidence on Blacky Ogiamir on the basis of very important issues, some of which are highlighted here under. One, we recall with pain and trouble that in, 2020, in 2013, the then governor of Edo State, Comrade Adams Oshomole, as a way of assisting poor traders in Edo State, gave a grant of 100 million and same sent through the Edo State Market Women Association with Mrs. Blacky Ogiamie was a major signatory and personal superintendent over the phone. The group also reserved to pass a vote of no confidence on Ogiamie. She diverted the same and, the same and ensured only her clicks in Edo South got peanuts and nobody received the same grant in both Edo Central and Edo North. We were later informed that the said funds were diverted into her personal enterprise. Two, in, in our markets in Edo, Mrs. Blacky Ogiame, her co-travelers have become monsters, such that, such that only persons who are members of the EVO Union are allowed to apply with their trade without letting or hindrance, thereby subjecting poor market women to the dictates of Mrs. Ogiame and her co-travelers. Uh, there must be, therefore be an end to oppressions, intimidations, and artificial scarcity and inflation in our market occasioned by the greed and closeness of Mrs. Blacky Ogiame. Accordingly, we hereby pass vote of no confidence on Mrs. Blacky Ogiame owing to the fraudulent, oppressive, and corrupt practices as a bad market leader in a those states. Why in the next few days the relevant authorities will receive a petition on her infractions in a do market. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.